quite a long while, but you know, a lot has happened. As you can tell, the room behind me is ever so slightly different from what it was before. And this is because I have moved. So I'm just going to test my sound volume and make sure all is hunky dory. And then we can talk a bit more. So, first of all, I would just like to check that this is working. Brilliant, we have sound. So, I'm just going to prop my phone somewhere that I can attempt to see it. Or I can just throw it across the room. That also works, guys. Wouldn't recommend it, especially if it's a high-end phone. Never ever throw the phone across the room. The phone did not deserve it. So. <clears throat> yes, we have moved. We have relocated. Life, life is getting better, guys. It really is. So, what is happening with you guys? What have I missed? Talk to me. Tell me what has happened. Have we all stayed safe during the pandemic that's ongoing at the moment? It's it's a trial for sure. Life is life is definitely sent to uh, to test us. And it's all about how we deal with these situations that define us and make us unique as humans. Unfortunately for myself, I have had to shield for a very, very, very long time. Um, due to ongoing health issues, which are not important tonight. Tonight is about this little dragon. So, yeah. How have you? How have you all been? What's been happening? Where's? How's your weekend been? Fill me in. Tell me some stories. What's happened to you guys? I'm going to save slot, and I'm going to start number three, and we're going to go for Sparrow number one. And this is officially the start of season two, guys. So, we have all three of these games coming. And the other games will be announced in due course. So, yeah. With all that being said and done, let us jump straight in, guys. In the world of dragons. I wish I could do David Attenborough voice. That'd be so funny right now. Here we have the world of dragons. <clears throat> okay, rolling. Uh, uh, oh, uh, it's been peaceful here in the five worlds. Or is it <clears throat> six? For a dragon's age, we now have 12,000 treasure. Or is it 14,000? What about this Ganasty Ganok character? Now, I understand he's found a magic spell to turn gems into warriors for his cause. I'll take that question. Nasty Nork is a simple creature. Simple? He has been contained in a remote world and is no threat to the dragon kingdom. No threat! Besides, he is ugly. Ugly? Oh, that man. does it! <coughs> oh. 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 Huh? Looks like I've got some things to do. <laughs> so here we go. <coughs> Welcome to Art Sands. The adventure begins, guys. So, 
First off, I'll just give you a little pan around the area. So, first of all, we're gonna find out exactly what we need in this area. Hello, Sparks. So here we go. We need a hundred coins and four dragons. Right. So seems simple enough. And then we we'll jump down here. Slap him. Always get the coins. And we can charge, shoot him, shoot him again. There we go. So he is down. So. We just want to go around quickly and collect all the points. So there are 100 to collect. Alright, so we've done that. We might just shoot him since he's running past. <coughs> we shoot these to get um, butterflies which equal extra life and enables us to keep young sparks with us for the whole journey. Oh, that was not supposed to go like that. There we go, acquired a skill point. So skill points here are in the guidebook, which shows you where you are, and you can essentially travel between worlds and between levels as you wish when you open them. So, skill points are basically these little things you can do in each level and what they do is they open artwork at the end so as we're going through I'm going to do my best to try and get as many skill points as possible so upon completion we can have a little look-see and see what's what in the artwork so to <clears throat> Get a couple of coins. Okay, that's deceiving. Right, so we want to have a little roam around, don't we, guys? Really see the level. So this is a dead end. That's an extra life there. That's a bad guy there. That's some jewels there. Right. Okie dokie. So that's another level that we can access. Right. So the sheep regenerate. And they get quite tricky, these little creatures. Now when you're going to the unknown, it's always handy to have a few extra lives. So for now we're just collecting points. So in the world you have a certain amount of coins. You may even have a dragon egg to retrieve. And dragons to unlock. So. We will stop annoying about the rest of the camera and we'll go through a little tunnel. Right, we'll avoid him for now. So I know what you're thinking, how do we get up here? Well, don't do it like that, that's for sure. So remember, just run around to collect coins. If you press one, the, the control stick, the, the dragonfly will lead you to where coins exist or don't exist. Oh, 
There we go, that saves down. So. We now go up into here. This will take us to a higher level. And then you click that. And that. And then we want to just jump across. Get the coins there. Jump across. Get these, this coin here. Jump across. Right as well. Right. There we go back into the spell. And then we jump here. Shoot that. And then we jump across and float. I know I'm pretty late to the party on this game. But you know what? It is what it is. So if we go on back through here. So different coloured gems are worth different amounts of points. And then there's two down here. So that's 100% of them done. So now what we'll do is we'll go and locate all four dragons for this level. So there's two in this area. So first of all we'll go to this one. <coughs> Keep your horns on, Spyro! You have much to learn first. Do you know what the dragonfly following you is doing? Uh... His name is Sparks, and he's helping and protecting you. Keep an eye on him, and see what I mean. Right. So the dragons will give you little tips, or sometimes they'll just babble mindless stuff at you. It entirely depends. So let's get this one. <clears throat> Thank you for releasing me, Spyro. Free ten dragons in the artisan world, then find the balloonist. He'll transport you to the next world. What about nasty Nork? I'm going after him. Find dragons first. That's all I can tell you. Did I mention we can do side rolls as well? Just don't do that on a high ledge because you will plummet to one, uh, you will plummet to your death. And yes, I will be honest with you, there are going to be some deaths during this game. Um, but you know, it's all light-hearted fun. So we keep on running and we get this dude. Hey Spyro, press the jump button twice to glide. And and don't be afraid. Afraid? Of what? Falling from high mountain peaks? Plummeting into prehistoric glaciers? Oh, that. Yeah, Spyro Spyro's like a kid with like some major, major attitude. So, we have one dragon left to find. Um, I think it's down here. No. So, we go back up. <coughs> oh, yes, I remember exactly where it is. So we'll go on and run on up over there. Right, so yeah, we need to run on through this cave. Uh, 
and then we discover that it's not that cave. So we run back up. Because I've not played the game in a f about five minutes. <laughs> we'll take it on down here. And we'll zap some sheepies. The artisan's boss is through a portal in the dragon mouth, but you are not yet ready, Spyro. First, you must complete one of the other artisan lands. There we go. So that is uh, this level 100% complete. <clears throat> so while we are here, I'm gonna quickly do something. I'm gonna <clears throat> jump on Sulees. And we open a level called Sunny Flight. So <clears throat> we are going to go and find a world to do. I'm going to go ahead and go with Stone Hill. <clears throat> so yeah, that was level one fully complete. Something. Okay, fantastic. So, yes, anyone that's in the chat, messages will appear right here. So, we've got 200 coins, four dragons, and an egg. So, what we're gonna do is we're gonna, same as last time, zip around, sort out the coins. Okay, so let's go ramming. We got an extra life there. For the murder of the sheep. I love winding the sheep up. Whee! Sorry, he he did not ask for that. That was a bit brutal of me. I apologise to all yak lovers who may be in the chat. Or not in the chat as the case may be. I'm having fun. I'm gonna put some coins up. So 67, 68. So remember this place, we'll be back here soon. Let's show you about the level a little bit. This one. So, first of all, we'll deal with this area. So 
So in the not too distant uh, future, you know, hopefully things will begin to get better in terms of the world. Let's take out Mr. Wizard, another wizard. And uh, we'll run around here, get all these. Ow. Unnecessary old man. Right, so now we've cleared this area. So we'll go up. First of all, we'll go over here. We'll go the reverse way around and see what it's about, coin wise. <coughs> so there's like a skill point that you can actually acquire up here, but I'll show you that separately. So you get this two coins. these coins scattered points. What we'll do is we'll do a loop and we'll try to get as many as we can on the way through. So there's some coins down here. shall we? We'll take the key, as we do. This will open uh, a chest. They don't appear in every level, but they do a lot. So, now what we might as well do is we might as well just we'll come back to the dragons. There we go. <clears throat> this should provide us with some points. Okay, so there's 16 still out there somewhere. So, I don't know if I'll just miss something in the really... Let's use the dragon. Right, so the dragon's staying up here, okay.
Okay, so what we'll do then is we'll... Run up through here. So we'll go back up in here. Ah. I did not see them there. That is on my back. That is so bad of me. Right, okay. So, there's some up here. So, we're now just too short. There you are. Okay, so that's all 200 coins. So now, if we come on run along up here. But I haven't said that, I'm going to be releasing videos on exactly what to do. In not too distant future. So what we need to do now, is a skill point for here, which is... Burn the hidden pink tulip. So we'll have a look at that. We've also got to catch this guy for dragon egg. We're gonna get him. It does normally take a little while. <clears throat> so we got ourselves a dragon egg. Now a skill point, find the pink tulip. Okie dokie, so let's have a look. Okay, so basically burn it. And that's a skill point. So now what we want to do is we want to go and collect all the dragons. I'm so happy I'll make this a call. Ah, oh, what a shame. So, we'll collect him. <clears throat> Spyro, my friend. How about a hint on gliding? You bet. For the longest glide, press the jump button at the top of your jump, and try pressing the action button to drop down mid-flight. Thank you, sir. That information will be invaluable to us. I assure, I assure you, sir. And we will not let you down. Hashtag no survivors. So, we're now looking for a bone sheep. Right, so now we want to go down here. Let's see if I, uh, I did not mean to see that, guys. Uh, 
enough tomfoolery. Watch the dragonfly, Spyro. His color indicates his power. When he eats butterflies, he stays strong. Like me. Uh, sure. Right, so let's jump up. Right. Now, we want to go through one of the tunnels. See, now there's one out here. After you've freed all the dragons, okay. pass through this fancy vortex uh, thingamajigger. It'll take you back to the artisan home. But first, let me tell you a story. No thanks. See ya! Right, okay, so we've got that one. Then we have a little look. There should be one more. And here we have him. <clears throat> when you free a dragon or step on one of their platforms, you're saving your progress. That could be useful if you run into trouble. Not that you ever run into trouble, Spyro. Right, all dragons found. Uh, level 100% complete. We're gonna run back to the other guy. And then we're gonna go on home. Because we are just cool like that. That may be the least cool thing I've ever said in my life. But like if I was talk if I was in a talk show, I'd have been I'd have been cancelled by now. Oh boy, oh boy. Let's get that life. Because why not? Right, okay. So we wanna run back through the Where is the tunnel? Ah, hello. Right, we'll go through here. We'll run through here. And we'll complete the level, you yeah. know. The right way. Let's go home, folks. So once you've killed an enemy and you come back to them, uh, they drop orbs and the orbs also give you life. I mean, he, he sort of asked for that one, didn't he? Let's be honest. We have a laugh and follow him. So look at him. He asked for that. Make me follow him. So yeah, what we have done so far guys is we've done hundred percent of Artisans and hundred percent of Stonehill. Here we go. Just bear with me for one second guys. I'll be with you in just a moment. Just had a message from a good good friend of mine. Well, you know, sort of brother from another mother sort of friend. 
so we have we have Dark Hollow, Sunny Flight, and Town Square. So what do we what do we fancy? So I think we're probably gonna have a little <clears throat> a little walk through. No, that's the wrong place, so I'll just come from here. Okay, so what the intent is Here's see what else we've got. So out here we have another level. Oh that's how you do it. You do it with some skill and you have town square. So I think to end tonight off guys we will do town square <clears throat> bear with me guys I'm getting lots of messages So what we want to do is inquire to our loyal, right, so 200 coins, 4 dragons and an egg. So I think what we do is we'll get all the coins in this little area first and have ourselves some roast chicken. Let's have a look, shall we? Jump across. Get ourselves a little extra light. And then we will jump across again. Remember, we're just doing the coins first. So. Sometimes you gotta take it, yeah. There you are, guys. So, 
Hey, man. Alright, now you get all that. Now you get all these. Alright, so now you go back down here. I'm gonna take a chicken to get some life back. Okie dokie, so this can be quite annoying part, I'll be honest with you, but we will go for it. The idea is you got to jump around this corner, tuck in tight, but it's not always as simple as that, especially when you're me. Just bear with me. Coins, to be honest. We're not chasing him just yet. So let's have a look shall we? Okay, so we've got to go back up here. Two hundred coins. Where's that annoying old dweeb? So, right, what we'll do now. We'll go around and we'll start to collect the dragons. So we'll take this one first. <clears throat> Thanks, Spyro. <laughs> I have the worst itch on the tip of my wing. Did you know that you get your longest glides by pressing the jump button at the very top of your jump? <clears throat> so, now... We've got number one dragon. Let's go up here and get a second. <laughs> Spyro, do you see a man dressed in blue running around here? He's a thief. And he's stolen a dragon egg! You've right, got to calm down, down son. Calm and down. that egg! Run! Run! <laughs> I'm getting a little winded. 
Wow, I don't know what I just saw there. That was something special that was. And that's coming from me, saying that there was something special about that. Just bear in mind who I am. <laughs> Ow. See, I can't put it off so good before. Oh, well that went a bit tragic. So we're gonna go wee. That's fine. Right, okay. So now... Now we have to go back up and along. Oh, the tragedy. This guy could take us a while. Sneaky one. Oh, hello. How do you do? Oh dear. The stresses of chasing a little weird, creepy guy. We've all met a few weird people. So how has your day been so far, Mrs. Uh, Zero? Oh dear. That got him. Ha, take that. Right. Now, just two more dragons to collect, and then we can leave this foundation. Ah, oh. that's cool. I'm not too bad, just hopping around like a mad little dragon. So, right. I don't remember how to get up there, so we'll have to bear with me. Let's shoot some chickens. How is uh how is bat today? Such a Dragon's got a little, a little camp skip. Square Spyro. Ah. Begin exploring by so gliding what? to that area with the bulls. Is Use it a secret project a or look. Or do you wanna maybe send that to me on um on you know, Discord where it can't be seen? Ah. 
that, oh, come on, I was so tired to that. Don't even do this to me now. My thing's trying to tell me I haven't got sufficient uh, stuff to broadcast. Well, we will not go quietly. No, no, no. I mean, my internet service has been like tragic since I moved. Uh, not what I'm paying for. Tisk, tisk, tisk. me Spyro. Oh, you can that's always cute. check your progress like by accessing the guidebook through the pause menu. Sounds good. So, we have found all dragons, we got the skill point, we got the coins, we got the dragon egg. Let us leave this level. The game is pure chaos, so we have... Ah. Fine, I'll go the long way round. Now we're gonna go into that into Dark Hollow. And this one will be probably the last level for this stream. Because I do want to have a run through and a little check on the on the next bit because I obviously don't want it to, you guys to be forced to sit there watching me go over and over and over the same little bit again. So I'm going to work it out and see what I can uh, work out. So in here we need a hundred coins and three dragons. Radio. Take that. Hit me with a big old belly.
Right, now we run all around here. Right, so we... Oh, there's one. A sneaky little one hiding. So we want to go back down here. Okay, okay, so. Oh yes, it is. It's it's one of them. It's nostalgia, nostalgia from from way back when when I was a, a young whippersnapper. Come here, froggy woggy. Thank you. Okay, we have no choice but to get Darius. <clears throat> Big enemies like this north with the club cannot be charged. But a quick flame, that should defeat them. Thank you, sir. Thank you for your kind, kind knowledge. Right. So we're now two dragons short. So we shall have a look. Want to know a secret? Use the action button when you want to zoom in and look around. 
Paul, your secret's safe with me. So what he's all about is this, basically. You can have a look around and see what's good, what's bad, and what's what, basically. And you press you that by using triangle. So it must be down the other end. I can't stall, um, let's have a look. Because it's dragging a little bit, so let's go down here. I'm missing something. I think I might be. Book. Okay, so there's uh, there is a dragon in here somewhere. I don't think it's down here because it's just a big circle.
tiny bit lost. Um, I think what's going to be best. Ah, I think I know what, what I've done. So let's go here. I can see the wing from here. It's okay, people, we are saved. There we go, guys. <clears throat> oh, it's you. I wasn't sure if you'd escape those annoying little creatures. Of course, they wouldn't bother me, but here's a hint. Their metal armor is fireproof, but a charge attack will take care of them. Thank you, sir. Thank you. And now we want to go to... Right, so we want to come up here again. Here, there you are, guys. That is that one done. What can we say? <clears throat> I'll tell you what, I'm feeling amusing, so I'm gonna do it. I think. I will go and give Sunny Flight a go. So this one is a I keep the timer up level. I don't remember how to do it or what's in this one. So it may take me a few little attempts to work it out. So now we want the aeroplanes. So Archways. So three. Okay, so I've done that slightly wrong, guys. Okay, okay. Retry. So what I want to do is I want to go for the archways first.
do nothing. Okay, retry. So I think how I did it the last time is probably gonna work. So straight in. Okay, that was all out of chaos. So I sort of want to go. So I'm gonna go Okie dokie guys, this will be where I call it, call it a night for tonight, um, but we'll pick up on this on the next stream, so I hope you guys have a fantastic evening, and I'll see you guys next time, take it easy guys.